Hi guys, so this is the review of Repel Windproof Umbrella, Travel Umbrella. I will just describe you the product, I'll show it to you, and uh, I'll tell you what I think about it. For like $15, one of the reasons I bought it, it's quite cheap, and it had some good reviews. The one I bought was $15 because it was white. If it gets there, it gets there, I don't care. I just bought it because it was cheaper, and I was not very actually sure whether this umbrella was uh, good quality, so this is the one I bought. Here you can actually see it, that's the way it looks, it's quite small, it's not a very big umbrella, it's small, however, it is heavy, I must admit, it's not a very light one, I can't say how much it weighs, but it's not a light umbrella. So getting this thing out, it looks like your regular, regular umbrella, nothing very special about it, it's small, however, when you open it, let me open it. I'm not sure if the distance will be good enough. I'll try. Okay, I'll try it differently. So one of the things is it opens quite nicely. You just press the button out here and it will open. Nothing really special about it. However, if you want to close it, you just have to press the very same button. It will close. I won't do it right now. I will show you the joints that it has. And this thing is reliable, it's quite sturdy. The joints are well made, they are covered in plastic and it looks like a shield. So I've used it on a windy, windy, rainy weather and it, it was perfect, never bent, quite, quite sturdy. You see the springs here, that's the way it's made. And one thing that I was thinking about this umbrella that I didn't like is that the way it closes, it uses the very same mechanism that it opens it with. And what I thought is maybe not a very reliable thing, you know, but we'll see. I used it for a couple of months already and never broke. I will show you how to close this umbrella. Looks funny. Now look, you just press the button and it gets closed. Now, to open the umbrella, if you press the button, nothing will happen. You have to close it manually with your hands, and only then you can open it. That's one of the things to consider. So this mechanism, it seems, it may seem unreliable, but so far, as many times as I've used it, it works just perfect, never broke. We'll see if it stays like that, but right now, it works just fine. Now you have to close it, and it's... Oh, you see, it's hard to close it because you need a lot of strength, a lot of strength, a lot of strength to close it. But once you do, then you may open it again. Unless you've closed it completely, you cannot open it. So that's one of the things to consider. Apart from that, the umbrella is quite nice for its price and quite reliable so far. The only thing is that it's not a very big one, so it's only enough for one person, not more. Maybe two kids or one average person. But the size is small and you may fit it in your purse or whatever, wherever you need it. The material is quite good, it doesn't get wet, it does not attract the water at all, the water just slits from it and falls into the ground, it doesn't get wet. Not sure what the material is, it looks quite, quite strong strong and reliable in fact i'd say for this price it's probably the best buy you can get for like 15 20 dollars one of the best umbrellas you can get reliable which has some funny funny mechanism to open and close it if you find this product attractive for you you may find it on amazon the surface it, as it says the repel it does repel water completely water does not stay on the surface. The price is good, the feel is good. One of the downsides is it is heavy, but of course, if you want some reliable, reliable thing, it has to be heavy, of course. The weight is reliability, it always has been. Not sure about the mechanism, it works so far. So far it is a plus, so far it is a pro, but maybe someday it breaks, so it will become a con, but we'll see how it goes. Something tells me this thing may break in future, but we'll see, we'll see. So this was it guys, thank you guys for watching, stay tuned.